Right, the part where I talk about my mood and tomorrow, today we're gonna have these butterfly earrings. With this. Um, I feel very hungry right now. I'm not hangry yet, but I feel very hungry. And I also feel very supported because I just had a call with one colleague of mine and we were talking about making things happen. And hmm, actually, I don't like these earrings. Wait a minute, I need to get So, um, right. Not, it's not that I don't like these earrings, but I think these are too white and that has silver tone, so it didn't really look good visually. So what I'm doing, I'm just using these pearly looking earrings which is gonna go with my idea of my hair as well so i i feel good because i feel supported by my friends friends are the family that we choose and one of them i just spoken to we met in bali this year when i was doing my teacher's qualification uh, on metaphysical anatomy certification and you know like sometimes you don't get to speak with some people that much but then you catch up at some time and then you just feel like really supported so that's exactly what happened and yeah so apart from being hungry otherwise i'm okay um there is some okay uh another thing that i'm feeling right now there is a part of me so there are lots of parts in each of us but in me at the moment i'm also feeling one part of me who's scared of making huge changes and kind of creating life that i want so there is part on in me which does not believe that i can create the life that i want because it doesn't really recognizes its value so that part's value so the part is disconnected from my sense of value and therefore it kind of like i feel some resistance to what i'm doing right now and in um, emotionally integrative approach uh what we do is instead of like no this is nonsense we kind of like we take it we look at it and then we kind of like take it as part of ourselves so by even speaking about it right now what i'm doing i'm recognizing and i'm validating the part in me which which feels like a small child so probably it has been created when i was pretty small and i was not able to do things for myself so it was probably something some situation or a series of situations where i really really wanted something and i couldn't get it and I didn't want things to be the way they were, but I couldn't change them. Because when we children, when we are children, we are not able to do that. And sometimes we take this feeling of restriction and limitation into our adult life. And therefore, even though we can already do, you know, whatever we choose to do, in most cases, there is still this feeling of restriction and that we can't quite do what we want to do. So, um, yeah, so the question of the day for me and the energy for me today to work with is what is preventing me right now to really build the life that I want? Because I did some steps and now it feels like I stopped because there is some resistance. So that's what is going on right now. Okay. Um, so you don't, you're not seeing end results, you're seeing me in the in a middle of processing it and the purpose of the mood diary in me talking about what I feel authentically is to understand that, you know, like all the teachers and all the gurus and all the people who speak about stuff, you know, metaphysical stuff, law of attraction, things like that we don't really at the end point of the bliss 24 7 none of 
us are. I'm talking about the human species. You know, they say if, if we were already enlightened to the degree and so evolved that there is nothing for us in here, we wouldn't be in here. So, we are in here because there is something for us to learn, to process, to expand and I'm in the process of doing that today. So my wish for you today is if there is something that you're struggling with right now is to recognize it is normal. Nothing has gone wrong with you. Whatever is happening is because of experiences in your life that you had, because of interpretations that you made, because of beliefs that you have picked up and some of the beliefs might be not even yours. And at the moment, the way you are experiencing the situation and you're struggling with it, it's not because there is something wrong with you, it's because everything is right with you. So you're recognizing that the situation that you're struggling with is not in your highest alignment and is not in your part of joy. So there is something that needs to change, right? So there is something that could be done better, right? So there is something, there are some adjustments that you need to make and it's not to kind of make yourself even work harder or stricter is to kind of like recognize the other aspects that are suffering because of the situation and do things change things in a way that those other aspects of you that are suffering right now are taken into consideration so in my case how it looks like okay I am taking into consideration the aspect of me who is hopeless about being able to create the life for me that I want. And I understand that from that perspective, it looks impossible, hopeless, helpless, and kind of like a futile process. So I'm not going to require from myself to go like with the blinders, but I will consider that when doing things. And when this feeling will appear, I will recognize it and I will recognize validity of it. So, thank you very much for watching and I will see you tomorrow. Meanwhile, have a wonderful beginning of your week and enjoy your Monday. Bye!